Welcome to Teaching Reading Strategies, Training Module 2, Reading and Spelling Flashcards. The purpose of this training module is to show you how to use the reading and spelling flashcards. The 586 reading and spelling flashcards have been designed to support the explicit and systematic phonics-based reading and spelling instruction of the Teaching Reading Strategies program. The flashcards assist with memorization, blending, spelling, and word building and are used throughout the program. Both print and digital formats of the Teaching Reading Strategies program include 8.5 by 11 inch copies of all 586 cards. Teachers use these pages for display and may choose to copy, cut, and collate individual sets for each of their students or teachers may order sets of the Reading and Spelling Flashcards from the publisher. The Reading and Spelling Flashcards are sold in packs of 10 and are reasonably priced. The 586 flashcards are heavy-duty cardstock with writable surfaces to allow students to add rare sound spellings and additional spelling words. The cards are business card size, so they're ideal for spreading out on small surface areas such as student desks. Because there are so many cards, keeping organized is essential. The reading and spelling flashcards are color-coded and rubber-banded in subsets. Storage boxes provided with the sets keep cards from getting lost. Make sure to have your students write their names on the storage boxes. The Teaching Reading Strategies program includes fun and challenging reading and spelling flashcard games. The blending, spelling, and word-building games correspond with the instructional sequence of the full year and half year intensive programs. The reading and spelling flashcard games are included in the appendix before the cards. Your students will love playing these games. Let's take a look at some samples of the reading and spelling flashcard games to see how they support the phonics, spelling, word building, and syllabication activities in the Teaching Reading Strategies program. Let's play a few of the easy, medium, and difficult level games. A number of the easy level games are designed to teach students to master the names, sounds, and spellings on each of the animal sound spelling cards. For example, Bingo, a favorite of many students. Students pick 25 animal sound spelling cards and arrange on a desk or table in rows of 5 by 5. The teacher says the animal name, and the students turn over the card, etc. The first five in a row horizontally, vertically, or diagonally wins. Feel free to use a bonus card, as in the example. Another game, Find the Sound. Students spread out the animal sound spelling cards face up, and teachers say the sound. Students pick up the card. Students who pick up the most cards in the time allotted are the winners. Another game, What's Missing? The teacher shows the animal sound spelling card and hides a spelling. Say the missing spelling. A point for each identification. The medium level games combine focused animal sound spelling cards and consonant blend cards to practice spelling and blending. Here's a great game. Put them in the blender. The teacher spreads out selected animal sound spelling cards and consonant blend cards face up on the projector, board, or table, arranged as a word. The teacher points to each card and the students say the sound. Then the teacher has the students blend the sounds. Or how about Ryman Simon? Students select onsets, which are the beginning letter or letters of a word, from their own animal sound spelling cards and consonant blend cards to form a deck to play. The teacher then forms an end rhyme from the animal sound spelling cards and consonant blend cards on the projector, board, or table and says, Simon says, play your cards to complete as many rhymes as you can. For example, the teacher places the long I as in Ibex card, followed by the dog card to form the I'd end rhyme. Students play, for example, the horse, raccoon, seagull, tiger, wolf, br, pr, str, for these words. Feel free to make a snide comment and teach the sn, i'd, 
blend just for fun. Or how about the word jumble? The teacher spreads out the animal sound spelling cards and consonant blend cards face up on the projector, board, or table to form a word, but in mixed order, jumbled up. Students are to unscramble the word, placing the cards in the correct order. Here are some of the difficult level sample games that focus on blending spelling and vocabulary word parts. Show me the spellings. The teacher says the word, students select the animal sound spelling cards and consonant blend cards, which represent the sounds and lay them out on their desks in correct order. Students use their fingers to point underneath the correct spellings and the teacher checks and corrects for accuracy. Experienced reading teachers know that not all struggling readers respond to the same instructional methods. Although teaching reading strategies provides explicit and systematic phonics instruction, not all of our language is phonetically regular. In addition to the phonetically regular reading and spelling flashcard games, the reading and spelling flashcards provide individualized practice in non-phonetic word parts and words. The Diagnostic Sight Words Assessments in Rhymes, also known as Word Families, Outlaw Words, also known as Sight Words, and the Greek and Latin prefix and suffixes will indicate which word parts or words have not yet been mastered by your students. The Reading and Spelling Flashcards will help your students memorize these word parts and words through games and individual practice. These sight word cards include 90 Rhymes Flashcards, 108 Outlaw Word Flashcards, 60 Greek and Latin Prefix and Suffix Flashcards, 60 Vowel and Vowel Team Spelling Flashcards, 90 Consonant and Consonant Blend Spelling Flashcards. 30 Most Commonly Confused Homonym Spelling Flashcards. And 60 Most Often Misspelled Challenge Word Flashcards. Your students will love the wordplay in these games, and they will significantly improve their phonics, spelling, syllabication, and vocabulary skills with the reading and spelling flashcards.